talk about your glorious backfires. This one is shaping up to be a legendary backfire. This is a group called Black Girl Gamers. And Black Girl Gamers wants you to know that they do not have discriminatory hiring practices at all. Why would anyone believe that? Why would anyone believe that? Black Girl Gamer says right here, we're addressing the recent allegations published on thatpartplace.com about discriminatory hiring practices within Black Girl Gamers. These claims are false and were made without pri uh, prior fact checking or verification from us or our representatives. And they continue to go on through this and they get to this point here where it says, we will continue to pursue further action against anyone who persists in spreading false and defamatory information about black girl gamers, its founder, and its contractors and partners. Well, okay. We value the talent and, contrib and contributions of all of the collaborators, and we are committed to continuing to do so. Thank you to our community for the ongoing support. It's a little bit different tweet than maybe something like this that was uh, a few weeks ago, where it says... Gamers that thought the industry revolved around them and their comforts are now realizing it doesn't. That is from Black Girl Gamers, where they got absolutely annihilated and ratioed on social media for disrespecting gamers. And it's just getting better because that part place has an attorney and their attorney. And this is a super chat from Friday Night Tights that I just got done uh, being on. And we had a great show. Ron Coleman. Ron Coleman says they managed to start up with the only YouTube crew that comes with its own First Amendment slash defamation lawyer with 239,000 followers on X. So yeah, I'm guessing DEI in action here. That is from Ron Coleman. We have Ron Coleman, who's also on Twitter, 230, or now 241,000, um, even retweeted a little segment here that Valiant Renegade clipped from Friday Night Tights. And do you think that somebody like Ron Coleman is going to be messing around? I don't think so. And the fact that they have decided to target literally anyone um, that is having an opinion on them, much less someone that's represented by Ron Coleman, is absolutely hilarious. This is a video from Asmund Gold. Uh, and right here, Asmund Gold pretty much puts it into perspective right here. Check this out. To now gaming companies threatening legal action. Super being style consulting company Black Girl Gamers threatens legal action over that Park Place gaming website over defamatory allegations. They go to say that they will pursue legal action against anyone who links to the Park Place's article or spreads it in any manner. I want to read it. I want to see it for myself. Gentlemen, it has been a privilege editing for you tonight. Because like whenever I like this is I'm the kind of person that's like, you know, you got a spidey sense. I have a common sense. I feel like this is so extreme. I don't believe it. We're addressing recent applications published on that park place about discriminatory hiring practices within black girl gamers. These claims of us are false and prior to fact checking or verification from our representatives. Uh, where's the content creator part? Uh, content creators who reshared the false allegations against about our organization. We will continue to pursue further action against anyone who persists in spreading false and defamatory information against black girl gamers. Well, wouldn't that mean that they're suing themselves because they link to it themselves? Oh my goodness. It's so beautiful. You linked to it yourself. After you sit there and threaten people that are linking to this site and this article saying you're going to sue anyone for defamation, you linked it yourself. Absolutely glorious. Because, like, they did just link the website. And, like, if you go to the website, this is the website. It literally shows the website that they're telling people not to talk about. I wonder who wrote this. I, I'm sure it's someone who's really smart. <laughs> How do you do this to yourself? <laughs> How do you do this? Like, this is crazy. It's very smart. Yeah. It's a Streisand effect in action. It's not, though, because they're doing it themselves. <laughs> this is glorious. Like, watching this all play out, it, it truly is one of the great trolls uh, uh, in reverse because they're trolling themselves right now. And again, they deserve it when they're putting statements out there like this. Gamers that thought the industry revolved around them and their comforts are now realizing it doesn't. That puts it in perspective. That puts it into perspective right here with the type of people that you are dealing with. They hate you. They hate gaming. They hate the gaming industry. They hate anyone that considers themselves a gamer. 
And if you go and look at the article on thatparkplace.com, you know, the thing that the Black Girl Gamers Group linked to, then you, actually, we could just do that right now. Why, why don't we just click? Okay, look. Oh, okay. Well, Black Girl Gamers puts out a tweet. Well, let me let me click on this link right here. Oh, that takes me to thatparkplace.com. Uh, okay, well, that seems like a pretty cool website. Let me see what they have going on. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah. I mean, I have my... my uh, ratio messed up right here, but you literally can go to their website and look for yourself. And it's here live and in living color. Absolutely fantastic. This is one of the great backfires I've ever seen. And it's just playing out right before our very eyes. So you guys let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Uh, <laughs> whenever there's a, whenever there's a website that's, uh, defaming you and doing illegal practices and you don't want anyone to go to it, you should definitely have a statement an official statement that says on your Twitter account, Hey, this website right here, that's hyperlinked. Don't click this website and go to it. And anyone that links to this website, we're going to sue you for defamation. Absolutely fantastic. You guys have a great day. Thank you very much for checking out this video. And, of course, as always, you can go to our website, geeksandgamers.com, and you can check out all of the wonderful articles over there if you're interested. And we are currently rebuilding the website as we speak. So if you have not gone over there, please go check it out. We have forums over there, so you can jump in the forums and have any discussions that you like. And uh, I look forward to seeing all of you over there. So have a great day, and we will talk to you later.